Ladies and gentlemen, I now have the honor to, to declare Operation Omake officially launched. With the launch of Operation Omake early November by the Minister of Safety and Security, General Charles Nomolo, it was a clear indication from his office that no stone will be left unturned to fight crime. Fighting crime is not only walking from house to house or stop and search or roadblocks. It is also by searching vehicles, ensuring that all vehicles traveling on our roads are roadworthy. As you can see behind me at this roadblock between Vintuk and Okahanya, several vehicles were already being pulled over. Either the driver without a license, overloaded, or even cases where vehicles were totally unroadworthy and even transporting passengers. This operation is not only a Namibian police operation, but also a call by the Minister of Safety and Security to get involved the Vintuk City Police, the various neighborhood watches, the Women and Men Network in Katatura and the rest of the country. Since the start of this operation, several success stories can be shared with our viewers. Several firearms were confiscated. Apart from the firearms, sharp objects like knives, screwdrivers, machetes and even housebreaking tools were confiscated by either the Namibian police, the Vintuk City police, neighborhood watch members and even as far as the Women and Men Network Against Crime. This operation will continue until it's been deemed fit that all crime or criminals has no place in the Comas region or in Namibia as a whole. I am Franz Lotteren, reporting for Nampa News, Vintuk.